Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Frost and today I'm going to be bringing you guys Wednesday's edition of Moab Mayhem. And uh, yeah, today I'm actually bringing you guys an unoriginal Moab with an ACR here on Bakara or Bakara or whatever you guys want to call it, it doesn't really matter. And uh, yeah, I've actually got a few topics to talk about here today. And I just wanted to bring you, uh, you know, bring this sort of to you to get the attention of you guys and uh, try to seek some help maybe. Uh, from some of you guys, because I know some of you guys are really good with technology and stuff, so if you could help me out, please contact me on Skype or Twitter or anything uh, once you find out, obviously, what the issue is. But uh, before I get into all that, I just want to let you guys know about a few things of what happened to school today, because like I said, I will be going over that. And actually, not really much happened at school. Uh, I pretty much, uh, pretty much in metals class, I just uh, sand down my helmet again and stuff like that, and, uh, you know, got my fingers all rusty and stuff, and uh, washed my hand nine times. Just like I said yesterday. Anyway, uh, yeah. And then, obviously, I had Family Dynamics class and Intro to Electronics class. And that was actually fun. And Electronics is pretty fun. You get to build circuits and stuff and, you know, get to get electrocuted and stuff. It's it, it's really fun. You should try it out. Trust me. It's it's great time. Great time. Anyway, uh, yeah. So, in the last two classes, I actually have milling cabinet and applied tech, which is pretty much, uh, you know, wood shop and, uh, you know, wires and stuff. So it's pretty much, uh, I guess, an add-on to electronics, but uh, it's obviously not the same course or anything. But, uh, yeah, today actually, well, I mean, I sort of knew how to solder, but he just showed us some more techniques and stuff. So pretty much what we did, we just, you know, took some wires, we cut them with our wire strippers and... Obviously, stripped the wires with our wire strippers, took off the insulation and stuff, and then kind of like, you know, practice on soldering them together. I was pretty decent at it. I knew I was going to be anyway. Uh, not to be cocky or anything, but I've done it before. And, uh, yeah, it just showed us some, you know, new techniques and stuff to do it, and it actually really made it easier for me. So that's pretty cool. I know how to, no, I, I know how to solder now uh, better than I did before. So that's a great class. Anyway, uh, yeah, on to my technology problem. <laughs> This is nothing to do with wires or stuff, so don't worry about that. But uh, I guess it's to do with pretty much, I, I don't know, internet technology. So, uh, yeah, like I said before, I'm trying to get you guys to help me of how to live stream, okay? So, right off the bat, I just want to tell you guys, just to let you guys know before you even try to help me, is that I do not have an HD TV. I have a standard TV. So, uh, it's going to be a little different, I guess, with the input and output, but... Uh, I guess it would probably just make it uh, not full screen, I guess, like a, uh, um, I guess a wider aspect ratio, I guess that's how you'd say it, or a higher, I, I don't know, whatever, anyway, uh, yeah, just, uh, there's going to be black lines on the, screen, on the screen and stuff, but I don't care because I want to entertain you guys, and it doesn't really matter if there's black lines on the screen because uh, you guys can ignore it, you know, that awkward moment when you're watching like a widescreen movie or something, you never notice the black lines once you get actually into it. So, uh, yeah, that's how I feel about that. But I I honestly, I don't know how to do it. So if you guys could really help me out. Uh, like, I've tried to stream before, and, like, the audio is completely screwed up. And I don't know. It's just it's a weird experience for me live streaming. I know I don't have the best computer. I do have a really good Internet connection, though. I can stream fine. But the thing is with my computer and stuff, I don't know if I have the right equipment. I have XSplit. Well, I used to until they started charging for it. So I'm going to have to get that here soon. And, uh, yeah, try to live stream off that, but I really need your guys' help setting it up. Like, you know, all the settings for XSplit, the best, set, best settings, especially when I have a standard TV right now. Until I get my HD TV, uh, that should be soon, actually. But, uh, yeah, so please, uh, let me know. I will let you guys know as soon as I get XSplit, and, uh, we'll set up a test stream, maybe. And, uh, yeah, if you guys can hear me, I'll mess around with the settings in the stream and, uh, try to get the best I can. But you guys just gotta... You guys just gotta try to help me with this, because I honestly, I don't know how to do this, and I know a lot of YouTubers live stream, and I want to start too, because live streaming is the best, like, almost the best way to communicate with your subscribers, and just, you know, have fun and play with them and stuff. So, I really am looking forward to doing that, but I honestly, I don't have an, I don't have a fucking clue of how to live stream, so, if you guys could please help me out, I'm gonna try to get XSplit here soon. Uh, I just don't want to get XSplit if uh, one of you guys or someone that I find can't help me with it. I have YouTubed it millions of times, but it's all it's all they're they're all accustomed to HD TVs. I don't know if it's much different, but you know when I'm trying to set up the settings on XSplit, it's just it's completely retarded. And I don't know what to do, and uh, yeah, I just I don't enjoy myself uh, trying to live stream when the you know the quality's all bad and stuff. 
And, uh, yeah, the quality is bad anyway, because like I said, I do have a standard TV, so it is going to record in that. But, you know, it's, it, it, it's decent enough, but, you know, like, if I don't have settings right or something, it's not going to be decent enough. It's just going to be like it was recorded with a potato and, uh, you know, live streamed that way. So if you guys could help me out with the settings and stuff, I'm really not sure what to do in that technology department. I'm not really good with computers when it comes to uh, live streaming, getting settings right on certain things. But, yeah, if you guys could help me out with that, that'd be greatly appreciated. So, yeah. If you guys can't help, uh, at least try to find someone. If you know a friend, just please contact me on Skype, Twitter, uh, PM me on YouTube, or uh, I would say comment on this video, but, you know, there's not always a chance that I'm going to, you know, read that in time. But uh, I definitely always check my Skype uh, request. I accept pretty much everyone unless I have them blocked or something for some weird reason, which I really don't block many people, but yeah. So if you can help me with the live streaming, that'd be great. And, uh, you know, you could even play with me during the live stream or whatever you guys want to do. I just want to know, I just want to be able to live stream. That's pretty much all I want to be able to do. So, if you could help me out with that and uh, get that all situated, then that would be great. Uh, but, yeah, I really don't have that much to talk about, but I'm just going to make something out of my head. So, I actually seen the uh, world premiere zombies trailer today, and I'm actually going to, I'll try to do a breakdown for tomorrow. I just don't have the time right now. But I will try to do a breakdown for tomorrow. I can't promise you guys anything, but I will try my hardest on the end at the uh, when I get off school and stuff after school. I will make my Moab Mayhem episode, and I'll try to make the uh, zombie breakdown trailer and pop that out before Moab Mayhem. If I have time to do that, that'd be great. But uh, yeah, I can't promise you guys anything, so don't look forward to it. I mean, look forward to it, but just don't count on it. I, I will try my hardest though. Uh, you have my word on me trying my hardest. But I do lose this game 65 to 70, uh, 47, Jesus. 65 to 74, yeah, I lost. Okay. Um, 70, it doesn't even go up. No, wait, does it? No. In ground war, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, whatever. <laughs> That's pretty much it for this gameplay slash commentary. Hopefully you guys enjoyed Windows, Wednesday's edition of Moab Mayhem. And if you guys kill me with a live streaming situation, that'd be great. And I will talk to you guys later. See you on Xbox Live. Later, Gators. Bye. Beautiful.